<laughs> I'm sorry that you guys might hear the chewing. I really am eating car carrots, dog. Like, I really am. But considering that, like, only three or four of you are going to watch it and you guys are like my homies, at least I think so, then I hope you guys really don't mind. <clears throat> Aiden, you there? Meet us at the bar. Ice? Who's that? Who's Ice? Lawan. I bet it's Lawan or the doctor. Or both. <sighs> yep. You've done a lot for the city, Aiden. For the night runners. You'll be one of us someday, Aiden. You'll make a decent runner, won't you, Lawan? Huh? Ah, oh, the best. But as for today, hey, everyone, I wanted to say something. Hey! Everybody, hey! Hey! Shut up, all of you! Shut up! Frank's got something to say. By whatever authority remains in me, I hereby make Lawan officially and forever a night runner. And fuck yes! Frank! Yeah. Get the fuck out! Oh, Give him a beer! Frank? Uh, you mean. So. You're really bringing back the Night Runners? No, you're bringing them back. You and Aiden, in fact. You've already started. These old bastards are all former Night Runners who heard my broadcasts and came back. Oh, shit. But you, you did them one better. You grew up. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> See? The Creed. If Hakon's alive, it means you learn to forgive. You found balance. That's what being a night runner is really all about. What about you, Frank? Do you forgive? Oh shit! I also forgot the camera Your was on. Timing always sucked, Hakon. Sometimes, but maybe not this time. I thought you could use this. Where'd that come from? I've kept it with me all along, Frank. So what will it be, Chief? If Luan can forgive you, I guess I have no choice. Not a ringing endorsement, but I'll take what I can get. Good. Now, this is Luan's time, not yours. Step back and shut up. <laughs> Everybody. Get your asses up to the roof. Much better place for a ceremony than a fucking bar. Oh, yeah! I'm happy that, like, I didn't kill Today him. Today I am forged in you to serve a cause greater than myself. Today I am forged anew to serve a cause greater than myself. I shall be the sword that slays the enemies of mankind. I shall be the sword that slays the enemies of mankind. I shall be the shield behind which humanity rises again. I shall be the shield behind which humanity rises again. I shall be the light in the darkness. I shall be the light in the darkness. This is my sacrifice. This is my sacrifice. This is my pledge. This is my pledge. As a night runner. As a night runner. <laughs> I'm gonna make you proud. You already have, and I say that calls for celebration. Everyone, back down to the bar. Aiden, the GRE <laughs> doctor I told you about. <clears throat> it's Veronica Ryan. She lives in Old Villador. Are you kidding me? What? Well, she's one of the first people I met here. We were acquainted once. She used to come to the canteen. I guess I managed to avoid pissing her off during my booze hound days. Because I convinced her to help you. Can we talk before you leave, Aiden? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, sure, yeah. Ah! Oh, seems serious. Nice. <laughs> 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 okay. So, congratulations. Sorry for avoiding you. I just. You know what they say. If you're starting mm -hmm. to worry about someone, it means it's time to go. Yeah. 
What's the pilgrim saying? Neither of us need to worry anymore. Yeah, having Hakon back must be weird. <laughs> Tell me about it. Spent so much time wanting to kill him. But maybe, you know, maybe I never did because I never really wanted to. Maybe all I ever wanted was to stop hurting. Well, um, are you hurting now? Not really. Itchy, maybe. Like <clears throat> when an infection's healing. But I'm not in pain for the first time in... I don't know how long. So you're officially a night runner. How's that feel? <laughs> so strange. For so long, it was just Frank. And the Night Runners were just a ghost story of his. Now, we're like a fucking Insta family. Even hack on, for fuck's sake. Can you believe it? <clears throat> yeah, I can. I'm the one who made it happen. I'm quite frankly annoyed that I'm not a Night Runner. Go <clears throat> on, I. I was worried. Here it comes. When you left, after, um, after your place, I... Hackons and my place. <laughs> yeah, I can say that now. If I can say that, then it proves that you don't have to worry about me. Of course I do, especially now. I mean, I'll take it from a pilgrim. Happy people are vulnerable people. <laughs> Aren't you a buzzkill? It's true. No, it's just that after everything... We... I just... I just don't want to see you hurt again. <laughs> Next time I get hurt, I ain't gonna piss around so long before I kill the fucker. I guess I better quit while I'm ahead. Look, I'm sorry I bailed on you. I was just... No, it's okay. It, it was really none of my business. But I made it your business when I took you there. <laughs> Maybe I did it on purpose. On purpose? You've made me, and Frank, all this, your business. And look how much all of us have gained. Maybe I... I wanted you to know. <clears throat> but I was too chicken shit to come out and tell you so. So, we went shoe shopping. <laughs> right. Those fucking shoes. They look good on you. Okay. Oh my god. I've... I gotta go. I... To look for your sister, right? Sometimes I envy her. Envy her? How? That she means so much to someone. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Fuck, I'm talking bullshit. No. Just think. Frank's got something for you, Aiden. Yeah. The one. I'm coming, Hakon. You. The more things change. <clears throat> the more they stay the same. Uh, Frank found that doctor you were looking for. <clears throat> Veronica Ryan. Seems she used to work for the GRE. And I thought you can probably find her somewhere. I have more to tell you, Luan. No. No, we really do not, dog. Let's just fucking right fuck 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 right off. Um Hey. Let's 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 go. Okay. So again, apologize that I was eating. Uh, I was taking my lunch and, or not even lunch, technically dinner, but <clears throat> I was basically just taking a little lunch and uh, we did have to go back because the game was like, hey, yo, there's cutscenes. And you know, that happened. Um, who's Veronica, by the way? I don't remember no Veronica. Pilgrim, long. Hello, Barney. What brings you, pal? I'm looking for Dr. Veronica Ryan. You're not the only one, man. What do you mean? The good doctor's in trouble. And, uh, weird kind of trouble. You see, a group of renegades appeared in Old Villador. First, but they didn't attack the bazaar. Of course, we didn't tell them where... And where is Veronica? In a hideout. Vincenzo and a few of our people are protected. But the less people know about that... Where is it, Barney? You just can't walk away from a f the building is north of Quarry End. Courtesan Rose Street. 
but you didn't hear it from me. Thanks for the info. The folks say I'm the one always itching for a fight. Anyway, good luck, man. I ain't leaving the bizarre <sighs> I still won't kill him. Like, thanks for the info, but the first chance I get, I murder you. I don't know, it's really hard to ignore. Like, it's really hard to forgive someone when, uh, you know, they killed a teenager. I know, like, I say this a lot in the videos, but I don't know, man. The way the kid died was just, it was fucked up. The kid had, the kid was holding his organs in, like, Aiden. Vicenzo. Thank God. Wait, where's Veronica? She managed to escape. I need to find her. Do you know where she is now? No. But we can try to contact her. Veronica? Veronica? Are you safe? Veronica? Shit. Something's not right. Yes. I'm safe. Are you? Oh, I am now. There is someone who needs to speak to you. Yeah, Dr. Ryan? I'm Aiden. I know that you're being hunted by the renegades. Hurry, Aiden. More renegades may be here any minute. Frank told me you worked for the GRE. <clears throat> I need access to the GRE database in the observatory. I, I have a GRE key. A GRE access key? That's what I've been told. You think you can... Let's meet. I'll be in a small building near the dam, not far from the observatory. Okay, I'll go... Wait, hello? Be careful, Aiden. The place is soaked in chemicals. I will. Thanks for the heads up, Vincenzo. Thank you. I'm lucky you showed up. Farewell, Aiden. Farewell. And we're not gonna ask if Vincenzo can make it back on his own? He better. If I learn he died, I'm gonna be fucking mad. Oh. It's you. Had a feeling we'd cross paths sooner or later. You patched up Barney, right? He whimpered like a baby as soon as he saw the needle. And those renegades, why are they after you? Probably the same reason as you. To access the GRE <coughs> database. What do you want from it, Aiden? Why are you risking so much? I'm looking for my sister. Your sister was in the GRE? She... No, she was a prisoner. I haven't seen her in 15 years. A prisoner? You mean a test subject? I don't know what I'll find. She's... She's the only family I've got. The only answer to what Waltz has done to us. Waltz? He held us there. Had a hobby of experimenting on kids. Did you know about that? I was only a mid-level doctor, Aiden. I'm sorry. Want to know anything else? Or can we go? Why are you helping me? Are you looking for something in the database as well? Aiden. Those vaults contain my organization's biggest secrets. Oh. I almost died because I was a part of it. I need to know what they were hiding. What if you don't like what you discover? Nothing ventured, nothing gained. That is true. How did a GRE doctor wind up at the bazaar? By not letting <clears throat> anyone know I was a GRE doctor. <laughs> that's, fine. that's fair. After the revolution, the GRE were blamed for the disaster. Personnel were rounded up and... Executed. <clears throat> People used revenge to relieve the pain. Doesn't matter if it doesn't work. What happened, happened. That's fair. How are you planning to get- Look, there's a security tunnel. Give me the key. Are you sure the key is functional? Well, it has been. Maybe the problem is that the building has no electricity. Is there any other way to get in there? It depends how much we're prepared to risk. A lot, if you ask me. Okay. And come with me. Um, okay. Bright as fuck, homie. <clears throat> You're not gonna tell me to go through the fucking 
the thing, right? See those domes? Sure, but the place is flooded with chemicals. The GRE had a solution for that. When they created the THV Gen Mod, they had to protect their employees from exposure. But the THV what? The chemicals. <clears throat> they came up with blockers. Shots that would shield their workers for a few minutes from the fumes. Fortunately, I still have two doses. Had a feeling they'd come in handy one day. Well, those must be worth a pretty penny. They are extremely rare. For now, we will need only one for you. So let's do this. When you get there, first restore the power. Then I'll be able to join you. Hold out your arm. Remember, the shot shields you from the chemicals for a limited time only. Can't I take the other one too? No, not at the same time. This stuff's too strong. Go as fast as you can to the smaller dome, and from there to the higher one. You should find a door leading inside. There. You'll be safe. Then head to the B block. There you should find the building's main circuit breaker. As soon as you turn on the electricity, the security door will unlock, and I can join you by going through the tunnel I showed you. Now go. The blocker is working. <sighs> The blocker is working. That blocker won't protect you forever. Wild. I feel like this is not a good time to Oh god, the blocker has like sec Oh shit, I, I gotta hurry up. White crystal. All that shit for a white crystal. Damn, there's a lot of them. Um over here. I got 30 seconds left. What the fuck? <laughs> Did you say I got like a two? I, I, I thought it was like two minutes, woman. Did I really just fall? Bro, that's what I get for trying to turn on my camera. I'm gonna die. Can't you just hold your breath? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. F okay, there we go. Good, good, good. Did I? Okay. Bro, I got literal seconds left. Circuit malfunction in block B. Emergency protocol initiated. Veronica, I made it through the chemicals to the first dome. Great. Now just get to the second one. Find a door, a hatch, or whatever leads underground. Right. <clears throat> um. How am I doing this? How the fuck am I doing this? Oh! I thought I was about to die there. Okay, cool. Um... Would you guys believe me if I said I still haven't cleaned my inventory up? <laughs> still haven't cleaned it up. Veronica, found the entrance. So far, so good. But how do you know this place so well, by the way? I was here just once, long ago. But I have a good memory. That sounds useful. Well, sometimes it's a curse. I feel that. Really. Veronica, I have a horde of infected here. Shit. I hoped it would be empty by now. Well, it isn't. I don't know if I can get through. Use the UV flashlight on your belt. That should keep them at bay. Just don't stop, Aiden. Let's go. Oh shit, okay. They're just like awake awake. Um Excuse me, sirs and or madams. Um go through here. Hey. Oh. Oh. This not looking too good, chief. Can I just Oh. I didn't even want to know what the fuck was over there. I saw yellow and big. That was.
was not wrong. <clears throat> oh, that felt good, that crack. Oh, that crack actually. Woo. Oh, um. Veronica, I made it. The electricity's on. Great. The security tunnel is open. I'll try to take the elevator down to you. Yeah, this place was quite the hive. Plenty of infected. But I got rid of them. They were people too, Aiden. They deserve respect. Uh. Aiden? What? What's going on? The elevator. It stopped. Yeah, I see. I think it blew a fuse. I'm checking. Do something. Quick. Please. Don't worry. I'll fix it. Please, don't leave me here. Don't be afraid. I, I just need a moment. Don't leave me. Don't leave me. Jeez, freaking the fuck out. <laughs> <laughs> 